Hello, everyone. This is Alchemisted. And this is going to be different from my normal vlogs because uh, this is a matter of great importance to me. I'm not going to be... I, I'm not going to be... This is not going to be a funny vlog or audio log at all. This is this is dead serious stuff. So I w first want to begin with a little bit of rumor control. There is news that the markup for SOPA, and allow me to readjust my headset, thank you, um, there is word going around that the markup for SOPA was delayed until 2012. This is false. This is not true. That was originally the decision made by the committee. However, those supporting SOPA have very sneakily rescheduled the markup for this coming Wednesday, December 21st, 2012. So this is not yet over. We still have a long fight ahead of us. And we have to oppose this. I've, I am convinced and I'm going... I am going to... I'm going to warn you right now, I'm going to get full-on patriotic in this audio log. Something pro you've probably never heard me... Never heard from me before. I'm not going to be funny. And I say this without irony or sarcasm that this is a that the opposition to SOPA is a battle we have no choice but to win because the alternative is horrifying and disgusting this is a global concern this is a problem not just for Americans though it will be our problem first but for people around the world because other countries may adopt this legislation should it pass muster here. And this legislation is disastrous on so many levels. You have heard a great deal about how damaging this will be to free speech. It will be equally demonstrating damaging to the basic infrastructure of the Internet. Many of the creative minds responsible for the creation of of the internet and the shaping of it into what it is today have made their voices heard about how technically infeasible and dangerous this legislation is and watching the congressman debate over it was horrifying watching them smile and smirk and reject any attempt to explain even in layman's terms what this will do and how technologically infeasible and hazardous it is in addition to what it will do to free speech was terrifying so I urge you to keep the phones ringing off the hook keep them ringing off the hook until Wednesday Keep them ringing on the, off the hook. Keep the, ma the the mail going. Keep tweeting. Because we proved on Friday that our voice is heard and our voice was loud when they adjourned early. We have proven that the entertainment industry is desperate to get this thing through in light of the massive waves of opposition to it. The move to almost secret, secretly move the markup to Wednesday during the congressional break this is they are not supposed to be there doing this right now they are supposed to be on leave at break they're supposed to be at home is the action of someone 
who is desperate to get this through. And we cannot let that happen. We have to be loud. We have to be clear. So to those of us, to those viewers live, who live in America, I implore you, continue fighting this. Do whatever you can. Don't fight with violence. Fight with words. Words are our most powerful weapon here. Shout them loud and clear and keep shouting them online and in mail and keep calling them. Keep the phones ringing. We cannot allow this to pass as members of a free nation. As the front lines of this fight because as I said this will surely spread if it passes here without doubt so we have a responsibility as the people of this country to oppose this I believe that deeply that that, that is our it is our duty to do this to make those voices heard and to raise as big a stink as possible to let them know we do not want this many of them have already damaged their political careers irreparably by sponsoring this I do not think Lamar Smith is getting reelected <laughs> I highly doubt that Obama is getting reelected after the, these past months. We need to raise, <clears throat> we need to call and mail and raise hell about this. If you call, be respectful. Note that know that we we cannot we cannot allow ourselves to descend into fits of swearing i know my previous vlog i was very upset and i well in and in my urging of people to oppose this now I I want you because one of the reasons why I'm not engaging in hyperbole right now is because I want you to hear my voice as clear and reasoned when I tell you that there are points in history there are, that will be retold in textbooks for decades or even centuries to come and this time now we are living in those there is an old Chinese curse may you live in interesting times these are interesting times this is something the opposition to SOPA and the NDAA which is something else you need to educate yourself on the opposition to either of these is something that will go down in history books whether this passes or fails, we're going to be reading about this in history books for decades to come. We're living history now, people, and we have to make it while it's still ours. While it's still ours to make. So please, keep pressing, keep shouting, keep fighting, and as I said, if you call, be respectful. Be, be respectful, be intelligent, don't shout obscenities at the people answering the phone, because odds are they're just people doing their jobs. We need to come across as a reasonable and informed people. So please monitor yourself when you call 
And I urge you to call. I urge you to write. I urge you to do whatever possible. If you enjoy watching... and. It, it, there was a Stow tag and a Star Trek tag on this on Twitter when I when I said I uploaded this video, and the reason was, uh, if you enjoy watching new voyages, if you enjoy watching uh, Hidden Frontier, the Helena Chronicles, if you enjoy watching Federation One and Star Trek Odyssey, if you enjoy watching Phoenix, if you enjoy watching Starship Exeter, if you enjoy watching Intrepid. There was a Stow tag. If you enjoy watching Stoked or anything on Jupiter Broadcasting, if you enjoy watching podcast UGC, if you enjoy uploading Star Trek Online footage, if you enjoy watching Rise of the Red Shirt, please chip in, call, write, do whatever you can. We cannot let this go through. This is our this is our job. And like I said, the between the NDAA Act of twenty twelve and SOPA, this is something we have no choice but to win. We have no choice. We cannot fail because the alternative is horrifying. I'm sorry if I've been depressing over the course of this vlog. I'm sorry if I'm not my usual cheerful self. None of you have ever heard me get all patriotic before. Uh... But yeah, there it is. Also, like before, if there's anything of mine, I don't know whether or not this is going to pass yet. We have a long road ahead of us till Wednesday. And it will feel long. I This will probably feel like the longest weekend I've experienced in a long time as I watch. And though I am not a religious man, pray... There's there's a saying that everyone's a that uh every man is a religious man in a foxhole and we're certainly in that now. But I would encourage if there's anything of mine, any any video of mine that you want to hang on to, I encourage you to download it and archive it. So that should the worst come to pass and sites such as YouTube get taken down, at least something that I've done, somebody will have it. It will be somewhere where someone will be able to enjoy. I will attempt to continue doing screenshot playthroughs on the site. I was going to do this anyways for Rise of the Red Shirt, but I will, end, I will probably end up doing it for whatever games I have. I'm really sick and I've been sick for this time and now I may not get a chance to finish Metroid Prime. <coughs> there are many there are many free games though, many fan games and I suppose such as uh, Super Mario Bros. Fusion which I've been wanting to do and I suppose I'll be doing a lot of those videos on a lot of those. There's the uh, Metroid 2 remake which I am unsure if it will survive this. So, there you are. Yeah, Super Mario Bros. Crossover, which again, I'm unsure if that will survive. Minecraft certainly will. Uh, Notch, long ago when S978 was going through, before it got before it got rolled into SOPA, Notch went on record and said that if this passed, he would add a provision that would allow people to make vid Minecraft videos. So I imagine I'll be doing a lot of Minecraft videos as well. 
Yeah. And of course, I'll continue doing audio logs. I've been I've recently begun doing a lot of these and I want to continue doing them. Because I enjoy the interaction with people who watch. And again, for one last time, I'm very sorry if I come across as very depressing right now, but this is I want I wanted to get this across that it is deadly serious what's going on right now. And it is our job to oppose this until it has, even after it's passed, we must protest this. We must let it be known that we don't want this, that this is wrong. So, like I said, this is going to be a very long weekend, and I'm, I'm sorry if I've depressed everyone. I'm going to end this with words that I said. I'm not going to end this uh, with my usual sign-off, because honestly, I don't know. Well, I will end. That's not true. Like I said, I'll continue to do stuff. There's plenty of free stuff out there, plenty of abandoned games out there that deserve recognition that I will, that I will do. Not being able to do stuff like Metroid Fusion and what, or Metroid Prime and what have you, will not limit it. Will not limit my videos at all. They may be gone, but there's plenty of stuff for me to do. <coughs> uh, Minecraft was an example. Another Metroid 2 remake was an example. Super Mario Bros. Fusion. There's plenty of fan stuff out there that's actually very good. Super Mario Bros. Crossover. And I imagine many game companies will add provisions that will allow people to record footage of their games because that m so much of the game industry gets free advertising out of Let's Plays and such that I can't imagine they won't. I have given Capcom... Like, Capcom and Bungie have gotten a crazy amount of free advertising out of me. Sometimes I'm a bit ashamed, in light of Capcom's actions, how much free advertising they got out of me. But they've still gotten it. So I cannot imagine that they will not... They get so much free advertising out of playthroughs and game footage, I can't imagine them not allowing this. But it will be a very, 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 very thin ice to walk on in terms of playthroughs if this gets passed. So, posted on the site, probably not anymore. Unless we're talking about the free, free, free stuff. We're looking at the cha the changing of the internet. We're looking at, at either the salvation of it or the death of it as we know it. So there is one more thing. And I urge, I urge you to protest. I urge you to protest politely. Be courteous. Be polite. If you call them, don't shout, don't swear, don't 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 engage in hyperbole. Let them know that you are saying this in sound mind, in calm voice. Say that you are opposed to this, and you er, uh, explain why, and urge them to vote against. Our voices are our most powerful weapons against this thing, and we must use them, and we must use them right. So, I'm going to say one last thing, and that is that since I was a young child, 
and I started school. These words have been seared into my soul, for I said them every day. Every day at the beginning of school, and I would like to repeat them here now. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. There is no justice in SOPA, and it will severely curtail liberty for us all. It is our duty to oppose this bill. It is our duty to make the public outcry loud and clear. We can do this because they're scared. That's why they snuck in the, week, the Wednesday meeting. They're scared of us now. The entertainment industry, the ones who are paying who are emptying their coffers with lob for lobbyists to push this thing are terrified that if public outcry is gets any louder SOPA will die where it sits it is a move of born out of pure desperation and it means that our voices are being heard. The massive online protests are working. Keep up the pressure. Let your representatives know where you stand. Implore them to vote no on this. And I'm done. For real this time. For for real this time. I'm sorry if I've depressed you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if you're. If some people are probably a little freaked out at me being getting all patriotic. Uh, but yes, I I, <laughs> I felt that this was an important message, and this is an important message that could only be that must only should only be said in total seriousness. So I will provide links to petitions. I will provide links to places you can email your senators. I will provide the whip list for your representatives. And I'm ashamed to say the man responsible for this, I feel like saying this every time, is a fellow Texan. And on behalf of those in Texas, I must express my horror at that. That a, that a fellow statesman is behind this. And I think I'm going to leave it there. I will leave resources in the description for you to make your voice heard. I will leave a whip list in the description uh, for you to be, which will sh show you who you need to call who is supporting this and who is opposed to it and those who are opposed to SOPA I urge you to thank them and encourage them and let them know that they are not alone in their opposition because it is an uphill battle for them fighting this and they they could use all the support that they can get so those tools will be in the description I urge you to use them if you have not already. I urge you to add your name to the list for Senator Wyden to read. The list of supporters for Sen Senator Wyden against SOPA. This is a fight that will go down in history. Uh, this is a peaceful protest and whether or not this bill passes we are we are living history right now
So we have no choice but to make it good. We have no choice but to win. And for real, for real, <laughs> I think I'm going to leave it there. I will end this with my usual sign-off. For even if this passes, this will not be the end of Elk Versus. This will not be the end of Rise of the Red Shirt. Both will continue in some capacity. Bookmark BlastFox.us because that is probably where they will continue. If YouTube goes down, which it may, if this passes. If you are a, fan, if you are a user of YouTube or Twitter, Flickr, Orkut, TwitLonger, Formspring, Facebook, any site that is supported by user-generated content or media or social media, please add your voice to the chorus who are opposing this. And I will, I, I will get off my soapbox now, for now. I will be back Monday or Tuesday uh, with a video reminding people that it is, in fact, on Wednesday and not delayed into 2012, as they have desperately tried to pass it off as. These are the actions of a frightened entertainment industry who knows who is on notice now and knows that they are on the clock they are desperately trying to get this through we cannot let them and I will sign off now for real for real for real and I urge you to action peaceful peaceful action I will see all of you later. So, later.